Good afternoon. My name is Jerry, owner of Walmart World. You can visit us on the World Wide Web at www.walmartworld.com. Today's segment we're talking about is VESA and what VESA means to you when trying to determine what Walmart brackets you're going to need for your TV. When you buy your TV, sometimes on some boxes, you may have a VESA row on the side of the box. It may say VESA 200 by 200, 600 by 200, 800 by 400. It all is determined by the size of the TV and the, and the patterns that the manufacturer put on back there. TV wall mounts also come out in VESA sizes, but they're very universal and, and, and adjustable in most cases. Once again, it depends upon the TV size that you purchase for your flat panel. On the back of the TV, on a flat panel, like on your LED, LCD, or plasma, you're going to have four mounting holes. You'll have one, two at the top, two at the bottom. Now, when we talk about the VESA as far as the vertical pattern, that's going to be between the bottom hole and the top hole. And in this case, it's seven to seven, eight inches, which is the same as 200 millimeters. Across the TV, which will be the horizontal, the VESA is on this TV is seven to seven, eight, which again is a VESA 200 by 200. TVs can range from 200 by 200 like these, the 400 by 200, the 600, it's all determined by the size of the TV and what the manufacturer recommends. Now, whenever you get a mount in, it's going to come in a package. You're going to get your vertical arms, like so. And also, very important, you're going to get your mounting bolt package, like this. It'll have an assortment of you know, mounting screws. You know, it may be 4 millimeter, 5, 6, or 8, in varying lengths. Also, in your package, you should have your lag bolt which come with the TV for screwing into the wood, you know, into the wood studs. And you're going to have some spacers. Spacers are very important when it comes down to putting the screws in the back of your set. What I tell my customers to do is like take out the, the right size screw, you know, they have to open them up. And what we want to find out is what's the depth of the hole before we put the vertical long one there. And what I mean by that is, is we don't want to take a screw like this. And let's say, for example, the depth is right to here. We don't want to just keep screwing on in and damage your TV set. So one of the first things we always do is we'll take a screw, and we'll take like a long one like this, or a mid-size one in a package, and we'll run it in the hole. And we'll finger tighten it until it bottoms out. Once again, we're trying to determine the whole depth. In this case here, we have about an eighth-inch depth, a gap like this left. Now our vertical arm is about a sixteenth of an inch thick. So if I put this vertical arm on as it sits right now with the screw, you know, put the screw in it, it could bottom out when I go to snug it down. We don't want to do that. We don't want to damage it. And so knowing that I have, like a, on this case, like an eighth inch depth, if I had a shoulder screw that might be a quarter inch shoulder, I would go with it. Now, if for some reason that happened to be the shortest screw and it was too long, that's where you take a spacer. And what you do then it's like you take your screw and you take a washer, and you apply it to your vertical arm like so, and then in your package, you'll take one of your spacers and you'll put that spacer in here before mounting your TV to take up that gap. And when we tighten up our screws, you know, you want to tighten it down tight, then go with like a snug tight. You know, you don't want to over tighten the screw and strip out the holes or whatever you do. But again, this segment is talking about VESA, you know, as far as the up, down, vertical and then cross with your horizontal and determine once again what is the right map for you. If you have any questions, you can email us at sales at walmatworld.com or give us a call at 318-423-2831. Again, that address is www.walmatworld.com. We hope you enjoyed this segment and look forward to bringing you more. Thank you.